Right, start with the guitar. It's just a standard Fender USA Strat from 1997. No modifications to it at all, just the same pickups, the same everything, except all the knobs have come off because they were just getting them away, so I just took them off and chucked them out because I'm always hitting them with my hand, so they're gone. But the guitar itself, it's just a standard 1997 USA Strat. I use Dear Dario gauge 10 strings. Gauge 10 seems just about right to me, it's not too thick, not too thin. I'm not really fussy on the make to be honest. Dear Dario, Ernie Ball, just any of those will do. I tend to go with Dear Dario. This is the amp I use, it's a Laney Tube Fusion TF50, whatever that means. It's just a really simple amp, I picked it up for like 150 quid at my local guitar shop. It's really simple, just two channels, clean and drive. The usual sort of settings on the on the dials. Not much to it really, just a cheap little Laney, cheap little Laney amp. This is my Hoover, which is often seen in the background of my videos. This is the little box where I get all of my effects from. It's called a Korg Pandora's box. I bought it in the 90s, they, they still make these, but not the same as this. If you really want to find this model, you could look on eBay and maybe find it on there. This was bought in 1997, so it's, it's 15 years old now, it's still going strong, but it's got some really nice effects in there. And the sound is incredible sometimes, really, what you can get out of this box. Yeah, this is what I use in my videos. It's got some nice effects. I'll just run through all the effects. These are the distortions, so it's got like scoop, crush, valve, high gain, hot box, tube, scream, all these different sort of effects. These are like the tone effects, so it's got low and high. The low and high, you can turn them up and down. This is the main effects. So there's like chorus, all these different choruses on there, flanger, vibe, delay vibe, phaser, tremolo, all the main effects, pan, wah, but mainly I just use the chorus, really, so I just put the chorus on, I have just a few bars of chorus. And it seems to do the trick, it gets that Frusciante sort of sound, a really subtle chorus, big sound that he has on the clean channel. This is like a room, room effect, hall, room, and pitch. Has delay on here as well, some delay, echo, and delay. This is the other good thing on here, it's got like a, a stack replicator, so it'll make your guitar sound like it's going through a Marshall stack. But well, it tries to anyway, it does a good job of it. Combo as well, so you've got combo and stack. And that's about it for this. And that's what I use for all of my effects. This is my fireplace, as seen in many of my videos. I like to dust this about twice a week and polish it, keeps it really shiny. These are the picks I use the Jim Dunlop, the really thick ones because I really like to hit the strings hard and I like, to just, I like to feel something thick in my hand when I'm strumming and I think when you're strumming with this you get the most out of your strat and you can really get under the strings and there's no, there's no resistance from the plectrum you can just hit as hard as you want and get the sound that you want because you know the sound from a guitar is what you put into it, is what you get out of a guitar, and this, these picks really help me to get the most out of the strap. If I've got a floppy pick in my hand that's bending, I can't get the sound I want, and it just feels uncomfortable in my fingers, so I just use these really thick ones.